Hi, Garrett. Uh, based on the amount of work you were able to get in during summer camp, do you feel ready for opening day? Yeah, absolutely. Um, you know, today presented a few challenges, uh, and uh, especially the jam there, getting out of that, uh, stretching the pitch count that inning, and then able to come back. Um, so pretty good. Uh, the three outings here plus the one before, I feel good. Do you like the fact that there were some challenges you had to get through in this one and kind of work through throughout the course of your outing? Yeah, I mean, for sure. Uh, the back-to-back -back homers uh, were, you know, undesirable from, from my perspective. Obviously, good for 40 and good for Miguel. Um, just kind of got into a position there where I was spraying some breaking balls. It just kind of became non-competitive, and, and, and I got in some fastball situations where I had to challenge guys, uh, and it was kind of a predictable count, and they got their swing off. Uh, and then, you know, kind of same thing happened with Duffy to restart uh, the jam. Um, you know, thought we could uh, get the ground ball to get the double or get out of it uh, with Florio. Um, you know, but a little bit of a misplay there was able to pick the team up and and we and, and we got through it. So it was good. What will the next five days be like? The anticipation as you wait to make your first official start as a New York Yankee. Yeah, I'm, I mean. Um, I'm excited. Uh, nothing's guaranteed in 2020, so I'll take it one day at a time. And, uh, you know, hopefully we get there. And, um, you know, because we, we put a lot of hard work in and guys have been grinding, um, you know, through the summer. So uh, excited, to, excited to start up for sure. Excited to start my career here as well. So thank you, Garrett. Yep. Ken David off. Go ahead. Floor is yours. You can go ahead and unmute. Sorry, Garrett. Um, do you, uh, do you know what your pitch count was exactly? 87. Thank you. And, uh, the, are those your typical walk up songs? Did you choose those? Uh, the uh, Rolling Stones or is that just, uh, just the stones in the first inning. Yeah. That's standard. Okay. Thank you. Ron Blum, go ahead and unmute. You have the next question. Garrett. It looked like after the home runs, uh, you were scowling there. Was that the legitimate self-directed anger there, or? Yeah, like I said, I, you know, I, I just kind of pigeonholed myself into the fastball count to Ford. I needed to challenge him. Uh, that pitch has been working for us against him up until that point. He put, he got his swing off, um, and then another non-competitive pitch. And Andohar obviously has already squared up my fastball before. Uh, you know, it leaked over the plate in, in, in a kind of a challenge situation, and, and I got beat again. Um, so, you know, I don't, I don't like to get beat. Um, but I, I, I thought we, you know, obviously got through the workload well and um, got some feel for the breaking ball back there because we needed to execute a couple to get out of the jam. And then throughout this whole summer, you're one of the leaders, not just on the Yankees, but among the whole player group. And as the back and forth went in the labor talks, were you upset at all by the stars getting tried to cut more by Major League Baseball? You would have been down to about five million. Uh, I mean, I, I think it. I think anytime those those kind of negotiations spill onto the public, they they leave a bad taste. Uh, not only not only in the fans' mouth, but uh, on both sides on both sides of the line. Um, you know, I, I think I think the players in general. I, I, I certainly I certainly didn't take it as kind of being singled out. Um, you know, we we think as a group, we think as a unit, um, and we just try to make the best decision. Uh, you know, for the integrity of the game and how how we go about that. And so, taking it personally, no. Um, you know, uh, it just it was it was unfortunate. It was so public. Thank you. Yep. Take the next question from Eric Boland. Eric, go ahead. Hey, Garrett, what, you know, you said, yes, absolutely, you feel ready for the regular season. What tells you that you're ready? Um, I, I mean, well, I'm able to get, I'm able to get the pitch count up and, and recover. Um, I've been taking it five days here for the last uh, three or four turns. Um, so, you know, hitting that routine is crucial, being able to recover. Um, I thought, like, I, you know, I, I thought obviously it's been sped up and, and there's been some challenges that, you know, uh, you, you may not normally have to overcome kind of in spring. And I think we've done the best job we can with some of those. Um, so, uh, you know, I, I got my pitches. Uh, I feel like, um, 
you know, I feel like I have a good toolbox to go to work with and try to win a ball game. Thanks, Gert. Take another from Marley Rivera. Marley, go ahead and unmute. Hey, Garrett, thanks so much for uh, taking the time. I hope uh, little Caden is doing well. But um, <laughs> good. Um, Garrett, we talked about the protocols last time with the ball and so on. Were you able to get a lot of clarification and maybe on the ones that you may have been confused about? Yeah, I mean, just the objective is to try to minimize as much of the passing around of the baseball as, as, as possible. So uh, I think there might be a little bit of a leeway uh, with maybe one or two players. Uh, but for the most part, I, I think as long as we just kind of keep the idea to, you know, just try to keep it as simple and not pass it around as much as we, you know, even though that's like totally against what, you know, we want to do, we get an out, we want to pass the ball around. Um, you know, so I missed that aspect of it. You know, worked out a little bit of the rosin bag situation. We're going to have to have somebody come out or, or either I need to take it out or and bring it back on kind of every inning because at one point we had like three or four out there and, and you know, somebody's going to trip over something like that. So, um, you know, those, those couple things we'll just have to keep, you know, keep, you know, stay focused on it and just try to be forward thinking to stay ahead of those. And, um, you know, we'll, we'll fall into the groove sooner rather than later. So. And just a quick follow up. How was the piped in crowd noise? Were you able to hear it at all or are you just too focused and it wasn't? Yeah, I, I heard it. I mean, you know, it's not the, it's not the same, right? I mean, like it kind of sounds the same, I guess, if you're in your zone and you're, and you're not really paying attention, but, uh, uh, the Yankee fans sound a lot better than the manufactured sound. Uh, just the, the general energy of people in the park is, is, is not there. Um, so, but uh, it, there was probably a moment or two of, 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 you know, of, of it just kind of being normal, I guess, from a certain extent, because, because it, it wasn't like I was catching myself, like all oh, this crowd noise is, is, is brutal. It's, um, and I'm not looking much up into the stands while I'm trying to throw pitches either. So um, I didn't mind it. I, I liked it better than, I guess, the music because it was kind of more white noise. Thank you. Take another from Brian Hoke. Brian, go ahead. Hey, Garrett. Um, you've waited a long time to pitch for the Yankees in a game that counts. What do you envision it's going to be like down in Washington? Um, I, <clears throat> gosh, um, it's going to be fun. Uh, it's it's uh, it's going to have fake crowd noise, and it's going to be 2020 coronavirus baseball, um, you know. But you know, get to put the road get to put the road jersey on for the first time. Uh, New York across the chest, so stoked about that. Um, you know, stoked about you know playing in some in some high stakes games with the boys. Uh, it's it's been a while since we've been out there to do that, so. Just generally excited, looking forward to it. Um, and, uh, you know, we'll start the preparation to, 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 try, to get a, try to get a W on the next 24 or 48 hours. So. Garrett, thank you.